Ta da! We're live! It's live! JT, what was your role in this? Well, Matt and I share the role of the workhorses. No, I'm gonna pull the rug out from your feet. Matt. Ask hey. me, Steve. Ask me. <laughs> Matt, what was your role in this? Conceptualizing. Yeah, you actually did. Because. I'd like to say oh that the God. seat beside for you. That uh, my comments are satirical, and JT does do a lot of work. <laughs> Matt, man, you just threw me under the bus so hard. That was nearly an hour long call. What was the length of that? 57 minutes. So, lesson of that. Alignment of values, number one. If you're ever doing a sales call and you get a gut feel that uh, they're not a good fit, you should end the sales call. Okay, alignment of values is very, very important, particularly service-based businesses. If you've got a long-term relationship, you've got to like the person that you want to be spending time with. You don't like them at point. More than enough fish in the ocean. Number two, uh, you, you can't be a relationship builder. It's the biggest myth out there at the moment that you're about building relationships. This guy's biggest problem is, is, uh, is one, he's thinking from a ma he's thinking of his manufacturing company, not a sales and marketing aligned company. The other thing as well is it's all about building relationships rather than finding people that are great fits, which is a dissonance because that was part of his value, right? So his distributors aren't maybe performing as well as they could, can't have the conversation, being very reactive, which is point number three. If you're in a marketplace right now and you're waiting for that thing to ring, if you're not doing any marketing, if you're not doing any way of promotion, if you're not getting outbound, you're missing out. And number four, the other problem we align with is there's no clear sales process. There's no way that they're doing something whilst being themselves. So of course you're going to be terrified if there's a big wing in every time. You're going to be absolutely terrified. And number five, there was no critical number. The company wasn't aligned to one sales revenue critical number project figure. Mate, you're missing out on bulk, bulk, bulk sales opportunity if you don't have a critical number and the team is not aligned to that. Your full attention as I demonstrate the safety features of the Saab 340 aircraft. It is a requirement to follow crew instructions. Step aside, Steve, go. I'm back. It's been a whirlwind trip to Mount Gambia. First time I've been to South Australia. Got to see nothing. Because it took, we had to go from Toowoomba to Brisbane, Brisbane to Melbourne, Melbourne to Mount Gambia. By the time I landed, it was night time. Ate some dinner. Uh, posted a thing on Facebook talking about how about we be kind on Facebook, which was uh, essentially a bit of a, actually just like chucked a thingy somewhere here, bing, uh, give you a bit more context around that, but then did a full day sales training in Mount Gambia yesterday, had a flight late out of Mount Gambia to Melbourne, thought I was going to miss the flight, went to the sales desk, I said the flight was closed, they got me on but I had to run two kilometres, back to Brisbane at 10 o'clock at night, drove home to Toowoomba, back at midnight, back into Friday. Had a few meetings, bought some music stuff, so we can have a go at it. <laughs> As you can see, really quality music that you're going to see behind the seat beside. But all in all... Okay, quiet. <laughs> all in all, it's been a big week. It's all happened. We've launched Eco, we've got plenty of members on there now. And I oh, onboarded a couple of new clients, which is crazy for this end of the year, but it's a testament that if you're willing to put the foot to the floor and work really hard in this last month, the last calendar month, there's still opportunity out there. So perhaps that's how I'd like to finish this. Don't give up, push to the finish line, keep working hard, there's stuff out there. Keep creating, keep innovating, keep thinking differently. Put your marketing strategy in place. Be honest. That's probably it, be honest. Yeah!
If you get one shot here, 